hello guys welcome back to the channel hope you guys are doing great mega love to my returning subscribers thank you for your support thank you for always tuning in if you are new here you are so welcome please consider subscribing as well so in today's video i'm going to show you how to make sorrel drink is a popular drink in Africa is popularly known as Zobo in Nigeria and for that I have pineapple two oranges lemon and cloves and here is the sorrel leaves so I'm gonna be telling you guys some of the health benefits of this sorrel drink as the video proceed so join me guys let's jump right in with a clean water and a teaspoon of salt i'm going to be soaking the sorrel leaf for a minute this is because the sorrel leaf has a lot of sand so i'm going to be soaking it so the sand can settle at the bottom plus before the packaging of this sorrel leaf, there has been a lot of touching here and there. So I like to wash it before I use it. Okay, back to the health benefits. Sorrel leaf has numerous health benefits. It contains calcium, potassium, magnesium, vitamin B, and folic acid, which help to produce new cells and maintain them plus it has the ability to help fight cancer diabetes and so on it works like an antibiotic it kills bacteria and worms it detoxifies and increases toxin removal can you just believe how the simple drink that sometimes we overlook can be this beneficial to our body? <laughs> Hell no, you don't know. Sometimes we overlook them, but they are so powerful. Okay, right here now, this is after a minute of soaking. And I'm just washing the, the leaf and I'm bringing them out of the water. Okay, look at the bowl. You see, you see sand in it. Can you take a good look, a closer look at it? There are lots of sand in it. That's why you need to wash your sorrel leaf before using them. So here is it after washing it. I'll just set aside. So here is my pineapple properly washed. Because I know I'm going to be using the back, I properly washed it with salt. But you can use vinegar if you prefer that. Just make sure you wash it properly. You don't want that sound. You don't want pesticide in your drink. So wash properly before a uh, cotton. Yeah. This juicy fruit is not only sweet, it also contains high amount of antioxidant because it has the ability to fight disease like cancer and so many others. Plus, it is high in vitamins, very rich in vitamin C. Yeah, you see the combination of this drink is not just going to give you a refreshing feeling. It is also going to give you body a good detox.
this pineapple is so tempting. I actually took the first one after testing it. It was sweet. Guys, I took another one. And I took another one. I was like, mm -mm. this pineapple is here for a mission. And I have to try to control my throat. Because if I don't, this pineapple is not going to... It's not going to reach its destination. So I have to. <laughs> oh my goodness. So sweet, guys. The pineapple is so sweet. And uh, I just managed to control my throat so that it can reach its destination. <laughs> so here's my lemon, guys. You guys know that that sauce is not complete with that lemon. So I'll just cut my lemon into uh, cubes. You can cut any to any shape that you want. Just uh, cut into a smaller size. Okay, guys, here's the pot that I'm going to be using to um, make the Zobo drink. And I will go in first with my pineapple peels. You see how big my pineapple peel is? <laughs> you can cut yours into smaller shape. You can cut it into smaller size. It doesn't really matter. Okay, I like to uh, go in first with the uh, pineapple peels because I wanted to produce as much juice as it can. And I'll go in with the um, lemon. Yeah. They are there to produce their juice properly. And here comes the um Zobo leaf. Bisap Sorel. I don't know what you call it in your country, but please leave a comment on the comment box. Tell us what you call it in your country. We would like to know. Okay, just um, spread it. And I'll go in with the clove. Clove is also high in antioxidant. Very good for detox. So here is the pineapple. Mm -hmm. I just added the pineapple. I added it lastly because I want it to be easy for me to bring out when i want to bring it out because i will be blending it to extract more juice so i'm gonna add um two uh is that two to three cups of um water Just make sure you add enough water to cover uh, the top, cover the whole thing. Yeah. So after mixing everything, cook for like 15 to 20 minutes. It doesn't take that much time to cook. You just need to bring it to a, a boiling uh, point. So here is it can see it's boiling now just mm, stir it you see look at that color I just love the color because it's so attractive <laughs> so I'm gonna bring out the pineapple because I want to blend them so here is it after bringing out the pineapple I'm just going to Blend it to a paste so I can extract more juice from it. Okay, here I'll be adding a little ginger to it. Because when you are talking about antioxidant, ginger is not left out. Okay, here's my bowl and I have my sieve there. I'm going to just extract um, the drink the Zobo Bisub Sorrel Drink, anyone you call it. Just leave a comment on the comment box and tell us what you call it in your country. 
So we are cheesecloth. I'm going to be using that as my cheesecloth. And here's the uh, pineapple puree. I'm just going to use that um, to extract the juice. Just be careful so that um, puree doesn't pour out. Um, gently squeeze so the juice can be coming out, coming out for you. Just the way you see on the screen. Squeeze as much as you can to extract the juice because you need it as the sweetener. We are not going to be adding sugar to this drink we're going to be using this as our sweetener so squeeze as much as you can to extract the juice so after squeezing here is the chaff And here is the drink. Mm -hmm. So colorful. And I'm going to be adding the uh, orange juice that I extracted. I did that off camera. So you just add it. We're using this as our sweetener. And I'm going to be adding uh, two tablespoons of... Uh, vanilla extract you can add honey if you prefer that or if you still want to add sugar it's up to you but i like it this way i don't want too much sugar in it so i just want it like this Hmm, here is our cup. So in it, just add some ice cube. If you want it chill, just add some ice cube. You want to take it just immediately. Add some ice cube and pour your drink right in. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Look at that. It doesn't even... <laughs> oh my God, that looks like red wine <laughs> oh my god cheers guys and thank you so much for watching see you in the next one stay blessed